So this is where Ian's living right now. And also the noise the characters make when they talk reminds me so much of Animal Crossing. Right, so we are called Faye. We have lovely pink hair in the shape of an arrow. Why not? <laughs> I guess. <laughs> so let's see. Jeez, these trees are even more muscular than he is. No wonder he moved here. Oh wow, yes, they are really beefed up trees. I didn't even notice that. That is insane. Wow, trees with six packs. Why not? <laughs> oh, I hope he's in a good mood. This news is gonna ruin his day. Uh oh, but I guess I have no choice. I have to tell him. It sort of reminds me of Adventure Time a little bit, but it's also quite different at the same time but it does have a few similarities there okay wow so of course this game is all about music i'm actually gonna have to turn this down a bit all right perfect the music of course is a high point for this game and it really shows um i am digging this right now <laughs> so let's see what we have here so we got our movement of course movement feels nice we have the menu and it's a proper RPG, so very, very cool. We got mods here. Wow, interesting. So we got, this is our, like, I guess this is our abilities. We got the face melter. Oh yeah, the hair shredder. And the tree molo. The first two just sound so badass, don't they? <laughs> they sound amazing. I like that. I'm really intrigued as to how the combat's gonna go on this because it looks quite different for sure and I haven't played many musical games but I find them really creative. So we have patches, oh cool, awesome, I like these little patches, we've got a guitarist patch, alright cool, we've got some merch here, I guess that makes sense, hearty berries, is this like, okay this is like a healing item, soothe your soul with berries friendly health tea infused with eight kinds of kindness, nice, okay, <laughs> sweet, well let's look around, let's see what we got here, I wanna, I wanna like interact with these muscular tea trees, what's this weird bush, not a fan of these moving bushes, what is that, that is just really weird but okay all these weird things i don't think i should leave until i find ian right okay we're looking for a dude called ian we're gonna give him some bad news apparently so that sucks for him <laughs> well we'll see what he what he thinks of our bad news right so these bushes i think they're a way to block us off from areas so i'm guessing we're gonna have something that will like get rid of these later okay this bush is moving yeah it's kind of creepy actually they look so out of place as well um hey you hello recently hatched oh my god <laughs> You look like the kind of puts that would sign up for a battle of the bands without considering it might be cursed. I love the music here. So cool. So groovy. Well, hey now, that's quite an assumption to be making. Am I wrong? Uh, no? <laughs> Thought as much. We have, we have no idea what we're getting into, apparently. You're wondering how to use that new power, huh? Effectively attacking with music does take a bit of practice, but you're in luck. What? K-quack? Oh my gosh, okay. He is the finest musician around. Maybe if you prove you're a winner, he'll teach you the basics. All right, K Quack, you have a really stupid name, but sure, I want to look around a little bit first. Got another one of those weird, weird bushes. What happens if I just, just walk off? Don't be daft, get back here. Well, it's worth a try. So can I speak to this little penguin thing? He's so tiny. What are you playing at? I am not K Quack. But why? Talk to Kukwak. Well, it was worth a try. <laughs> Alright, hey dude. Sorry, I only talk to winners. Oh, wow. Why is your hat on upside down? What's your deal, bro? What? Whoops, I talked to you. I guess that makes you a winner. Winner, winner, chicken dinner, right? <laughs> Congratulations. Let's see what you got. Alright, let's do this. Battle time. Hey, so you're a guitarist, huh? Let's hear it. Uh, once your marker reaches the end of the bar, that is. Um, okay, so here, what do I do? Uh, Y button, okay. Phase signature beat deals 8 to 18 damage to a single foe. Let's check this out. Let's battle with style, yo. 
<laughs> not bad. That's pretty basic stuff though. If you really want to stand a chance, you'll need to familiarize yourself with bar effects. Okay, fancier moves can add effects to you or your opponent's bar. These effects will greatly impact what happens in between turns. Come on, give me a real solo. Don't hold back now. Give me something with a bar effect. Okay, I'll try my best. This is a really interesting idea actually. I wasn't sure about this game when I first saw it, but this is is growing on me for sure. It's got a really unique style and things that I've never seen before for sure like mussels growing from trees. <laughs> so weird. I'm not 100% sure about the comedy though. It's a little hit or miss it seems. I feel like it's a bit childish at times but that's okay. Maybe some of it will connect with me but so far I'm loving this battle system. I love turn-based battles and um, this is amazing. It feels really good to, to use. Faye unleashes a dazzling solo dealing light melody damage to a single foe. Okay, so it applies two measures of pain to the enemy. <laughs> All right, let's do it. There she goes. Solo, solo there. Oh, okay. Interesting. It did something to his bars. Haha, <laughs> that's more like it. Um, so now he only has two bars he can use. See, now a portion of my bar has been inflicted with pain thanks to that solo. Now I'm going to take damage all the while my marker is passing through that particular measure of the bar. Ah, oh, so he can use it, but it takes damage from him. Right, I see, that makes sense. Of course, that's just one of many bar effects that you'll encounter. Sweet. But for now, let's keep it nice and painful. And oh, looky look, it's my turn. Oh no, <laughs> please don't hurt me. Oh, he poisoned me or something. <laughs> That really did a number on you, huh? But it's okay. I notice you've got some re restorative merch over there. Go on, have a swig. All right, how do I do that? Let's try this out. Right trigger. All right, I love this. It reminds me so much of Costume Quest. Like, just the style of it. It's just so quirky. And I love Costume Quest. I played both Costume Quests and they were amazing. Such cool games. I really hope they make a sequel to those, actually. All right, so let's heal myself. Uh, let's do this. I love how the cursor is a guitar pick as well. I love these small little details. There you go. Bet that went down a treat. It sure did. That cost you two stock to use, though. Stock is what you need to use any merch. So you don't have to worry about restocking merch individually all the time like an idiot. How rude. So you don't have to restock items. That's interesting. All right. Just be sure to keep your stock uh, stocked. Right. All right. I'm bored of this now. Tutorial over. What? Seriously? All right, then. I, I wanted to see more of that. I really liked that. That was cool. That combat system is really, really interesting. I like it a lot. I'm going to level with you. You're pretty naff. How rude. <laughs> but luckily for you, the monsters around these parts aren't very musically inclined either. Though to make things interesting, I may have taught a certain sick technique to a certain large snail. Okay, feel free to watch out for that. Come on, RH, let's bounce. All right. It's actually called RH. See you later, uh, Faye. Faye, huh? That sure is an easy name to rhyme stuff with. Would you like a diss track? I'm good, thanks. Actually, I wanted one. I'll have it for you later. Stash me up, okay? Uh, oh my. Right, okay. <laughs> they got some really weird vocab, but okay. <laughs> sure, like, whatever. It's, it's pretty unique. It definitely makes it unique, for sure. All right, let's continue. Let's see what else we find here. Big muscular trees. I like this very much. I feel like they're, they're like, gonna come to life. <laughs> I keep seeing these things. Oh yeah, those bushes. What the heck are they? I don't know. They look really out of place. What on earth is that? Oh my dear lord. I have no idea what that is. It looks really derpy for sure. All right, we've got different moves now. Let's try the A button. Strum the guitar at an outrageous speed, dealing minuscule damage to, to a single foe. But it also applies haste to your bar. Very nice indeed. Let's do that. It takes up a lot of that purple stuff. I have like, I don't know, mana or something. Oh, it, it seems to regenerate pretty fast though. I need to be careful with that. Let's see which one should I use. So that takes 30. That 
takes none. So this uh, this one here actually takes none of that purple. I'm not even sure what that is. I'm not sure, but it doesn't take any of it. So I'm going to use that for sure. And we got haste so we can have lots of turns, which is nice. Um, what did you just do to me? I have no idea. It would be nice if there was like a description or something to so I could see what he actually did to me. Because at this point, I have honestly no idea. Sid X. I got a new item here. Energizes the active character, restoring a portion of their max hype. Ah, so is the purple stuff called hype? I guess that makes sense. <laughs> cool. All right. So let's try this. We are going to do some pain to this guy here. This weird looking bush thing. <laughs> oh, he's dead. Oh, <laughs> it's over already. All right. Uh, beat dropped. A shrub bash view it in the mods vent menu okay I'm gonna check that out in a second when we get the opportunity to so let's go into the menu I didn't say it was in mods there also seems to be classes right now my classes show off and I'm also only level one and it does look like we might be able to get multiple characters on this game as well I am really intrigued as to what they're gonna do with this game this is a really interesting idea, actually. All right, let's see. Oh my God, that's a lot of muscular trees over there. What is this? What's this? Come see the amazing Babby Bass live in concert, Ian. That's the guy we're meant to be seeing, isn't it? But what's down this way? I just want to have a little look, see. I don't want to miss anything, you know? I want to see. I want to find all the stuff. Our first treasure. Nice. Uh, a god brain. Greatly increases the wearer's melody at the cost of power and defense. View it in the patch menu. Okay. I keep pressing start, but it's triangle. <laughs> I keep forgetting. So patches. We have a different one. So we did have this one, which increases the wearer's melody and hype regen. But this one greatly increases the wearer's melody at the cost of power and defense. All right, I guess we could try it out, I suppose. No harm in testing it out for sure. I'm not even sure if I've gone the right way, to be honest with you. Hey, dude, you are looking awesome. Let's see, Casio. Oh my God, he's got piano keys for hair. <laughs> Step right up, experience the ultimate keyboard demo. What are you doing? Demoing all the way out here. Yeah, a bit of a random place. Isn't it obvious? What kind of game demo would this be without a keyboard demo, eh? <laughs> Alright then. The demo button on the keyboard isn't working at the moment though. Sorry, but you'll have to get the full game to play the demo. <laughs> oh my god, that goes on for far too long. But you can't get the game, it's not out yet. <laughs> Um, okay then, let's continue on a little bit. Oh yeah, we got another another encounter here. I love the combat in this so far. It's so interesting. Alright, so we don't have any new skills though. We can escape. Let's like, I just want to see what, like how that is. Right, okay. Very, uh, very easy. So when you escape, the enemy actually disappears. So that's good to know. We can go this way. Oh, bloody hell. Screw going through here by myself. Um, okay. Was it like really bad? Okay. So when you go back to the next screen, the enemies seem to respawn. So that's also good to know. Finding out lots of things here. So that's cool. We're going to do use this B button. Faye shreds with her hair for light men melody damage to all foes. So this is like an AOE kind of skill, so that's cool. It also applies one measure of pain per enemy struck. That's nice. This move has a chance to backfire. Oh god, that, that doesn't sound nice. Um, okay, there we go. It didn't backfire, I don't think, but it kind of sucks that it does. Maybe it was like too overpowered or something. Slick moves! Oh yeah, there we go. Awesome. I really like that. That's so cool. That's an awesome idea for, for, for combat. I really like that. Um, all right. What's this? A soothing fish spring. So weird. The fish is emitting soothing melodies. Life and hype fully restored. Oh, okay. So that's just like a little, kind of like the little ponds and stuff you get in Final Fantasy when they like restore your life, or at least in the old Final Fantasy games anyway. So that's awesome. All right. We are going to do this one. I think I've like seen all of the skills now and I really like all of them actually they they are really cool skills all right we're going to do this one and then I think I am just going to do a normal attack oh I got haste as well I forgot that gave haste all right nice we got some xp the xp is going up insanely slow for a level one I have to say I'm barely getting anything at all those things don't give a lot what's this 
foreboding sign warning this this way leads to dread haunt crossing not very fun come see the amazing babby bass instead right um i actually did go that way but she wouldn't let me actually go anywhere so there's that um at least it kind of blocks you off because uh it looks like a dangerous area oh that's ian hey hey ian how you doing dude Faye, is that you he's got heart eyes you know it mate all right so i wonder if this guy's in my band what brings you to tonewood Aside from the gorgeous trunk hunks. <laughs> what? Yeah, those trees are really something. They're called trunk hunks. <laughs> okay. But uh, I came here because I got some uh, news. Okay. I kind of signed up for a Battle of the Bands contest. Oh, right on. I know, right? <laughs> the art style is so weird. Only it turns out it's a cursed tournament and now all the entrants can actually hurt people with music. Oh, right on. He doesn't care. And we have to fight the other bands to the death. Hell yeah. <laughs> He's loving it. And anyone who doesn't show up to the battle will be tracked down and killed by the demon gods of Hellblivion. Oh, dude. And rightly so. You're taking this very well. I was expecting something more like... Ah! <laughs> yeah, that. <laughs> Uh, what did he just see? What just happened? What's happening? How? Why? Who would do such a thing? How dare they chop down the hunk trunks? Tonewoods are the most beautiful, strongest trees in the whole world. They are sacred marvels of nature. Whoever did this will pay. Oh man, he's angry. I, I need to cool down. Yes, you do. Maybe they just needed some wood. I don't know. Um, okay. Prove to the... What? I didn't see that. Jam with the snail till it's dead in the ground. Beep, blib, blib, blub, 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 <laughs> Yes, I know what you mean. Open the way, that snail's gonna pay. What? That was so random. I love that one. Um, alright. Alright, I'm feeling better, but still. <laughs> what? No one's been able to chop down a tone wood before, and whoever did it is probably still out there. I mean, obviously, I could cut down a tone wood if I wanted to, but I would never. Either way, this forest is in danger. We've got to do something. What about the whole battle of the bands thing? That's kind of a, a big deal, you know? Oh. Oh, what, what was that? That sounded like Claire. Okay, I told you this forest was in danger. Let's go help her. Who the hell is Claire? A pal of mine. We go way back. Are you coming or not? I love, like, the close-ups that it does, like, on the little picture and stuff. I like that. I think it's done for, like, comedic value, and I like that. I suppose this could double as cursed band practice. That's the spirit all right, so we got our first party member. Sweet, we have Ian here. Very cool indeed. Let's see what moves he has. So he has strong tone. That's his signature move. That's the one that doesn't take any um, hype to use. So his class is well toned. He's like a buff skeleton. Interesting. We got mega pop slap, right? Okay, he stretches a string way out and let's go for a massive pop. Dealing moderate noise, right? Okay, we have zero hertz. He tunes his bass to the absolute lowest frequency possible, delivering heavy, heavy noise to all foes. So that's nice. It takes a lot of hype though. And then we have this one, uh, Fortifying Flex. He flexes, applying Fortify to your bar. Very nice. He's got a nice buff here for sure. All right, I'm interested to, to see him in action. He's got a patch as well, which increases his power and defense. Right, cool. All right, let's see if we can find out the mystery behind who's chopping down these these trees. Can I interact with this? No, it's like one of those, oh my God, why do you open doors like that? Jeez, can't you just use the door handle? <laughs> oh my God, what's this, a Jill Jillian? What's that, is that my fish? Ah, I see you found Gillian. Gillian or Gillian, I don't know. Say hi, Gillian, we're going with Gillian. Blob blob, what on earth, hello. I saved her life. Blub blub. No, you bloody didn't. Yes, I did. You were always getting caught in that lake. Look at all the hooks stuck in your face. I mean, sure, the first time I got caught was unplanned. But then I thought, this silver lodged in my face actually looks pretty sick. Oh my god, it's like a goth fish what's happening i don't know so i deliberately got caught a few more times to get more piercings whatever either way i did you a favor that was a dangerous lifestyle to maintain nah -uh. 
Yaha. On that note, it's been a while since my last piercing. It's about time I got another one. Care to help a girl out? Sure, okay, nice one. All I need is a spiky silver thing. Right, as you do. Just get me that and I'll do the rest. Thanks. Blub. <laughs> So random. I'm definitely enjoying this a lot, actually. Um, I didn't think that the comedy would be my kind of thing, but I'm actually really enjoying it. It's not like really, really funny or anything, but it's enough to make me giggle. So I like that. Um, so yeah, there's your front door. <laughs> you probably shouldn't have done that. This is where Ian keeps his broken door collection. Oh my god. <laughs> but why? With it is like it's like outrageous comedy from uh, what I can see here. Like totally absurd stupid comedy <laughs> i like it an old poster of the pro wrestler splash for gold ian's childhood hero okay i love that you still have that poster splash always was your favorite huh even though iris was clearly the better wrestler no uh iris was lame Pff, you're only really saying that because she's your mum. what what really huh <laughs> I still don't get why you never let me meet her. Because you'd embarrass me with all your fangirling. Oh, come on. You know I'm not like that. But is this the truth, though? Besides, aren't you more worried about your mum embarrassing you in front of your cool friends? I would be, but luckily for me, you're not cool at all. <gasps> How dare you. Okay, that was pretty good. How could you say that about her? All right, anything else? His fridge. The fridge is full of fish food for Jillian. Does he not eat himself? Ian, you know you don't have to refrigerate fish food, right? But where else am I going to put it? <laughs> I don't know. In the cabinet above the fish tank? Yeah, that's a good place. But that's where my food goes. What? What? <laughs> her reaction was the same as me <laughs> i love that i was like what what are you talking about what fishing memories okay this book is called fishing memories it's loaded with pictures of ian taking selfies with various fish hey sure there's one of jillian that's when we first met never thought i'd meet someone as white as me but there you go you should see the bait he used it should be in the back of the book all right found it wait this actually worked Hello, are you a fish and want to be immortalised? I am a keen fisherman and I would love to get a photo with you for my book. If you're down, tug the string and hold on tight. I look forward to meeting you. <laughs> oh my god, of course, why wouldn't it? Uh, I don't know. Has to be said, after reading the bait, I wasn't really thinking about what Ian might look like, but I definitely wasn't expecting that. Yeah, he probably gets that a lot. <laughs> Ian, how long have you been there? Uh, the whole time. I've just been running around with you for crying out loud. Oh yeah. <laughs> Derp. <laughs> I feel like this game is very self-conscious as well, which I really like. It's very cool. Also, I wonder if Faye is the only human-like looking character, because so far we got like a skeleton, like it does, it, oh, oh, never mind. There's a human here. Never mind. I just found one. <laughs> the characters are definitely diverse. I like that outstanding so the rumors were true did you know that the number of rings on the stump of a tone wood depicts how much the tree can bench <laughs> no it doesn't it depicts its age <laughs> but i like that better like i wish that was that was true <laughs> simply fascinating it was you wasn't it Good heavens, no. I would never dream of harming a micey tone wood. But I'd be lying if I said I wasn't benefiting from the situation. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay, then. There was something we could interact with on the wall over here. BB Red. What's this? What? AI? Might check. 1212. Is your boy BB Red talking about... Oh, it's too quick. No. Oh, I can't keep up. But it sounded insane. Can I do it again? One, two, one, two, yeah! Is your boy BB Red talking about that dread haunt crossing? Flowers know where the exit been. Hit up the road more blue than green. The spookiest scene I ever seen. What, what, ha ha! 2000 something. I didn't see the last word. Love that one. All right then, uh, sure. That, that was really random. This is such a weird game. Wow, it's a lady one, isn't it? I think. She's got an afro for a hair for a hairdo. <laughs> awesome. Alright, there's a way this way. 
but I just want to see real quick if there is any other alternative directions. Oh, and there's also a treasure chest up here. Awesome. I love how she kicks everything. Intimidate. With his stocky figure, Ian spooks the enemy force, dealing minuscule melody damage to a single foe. So we can now add this to his skills. So that's cool. I'm going to swap out the damage to all foes with this intimidate one because I'm kind of curious. Although I do want to try out the other one too. I wonder if I have any different ones on this character. I don't think I do actually. That's okay. Good to know. Good to know. All right, let's see if we can explore anywhere else. I'm not sure if there is any other ways to go actually. No, I don't think so. So it looks like there's only one direction to go, but I found a treasure chest, so it was totally worth exploring around. So that was nice. All right, let's see what we can find up here. I'm actually hoping for a boss fight. I think that'd be really cool, a <laughs> giant arm. Ah yes, the great arm of Tonewood. Only flexes the way open for those in the forest he deems worthy. I guess we got a forest to impress. I mean, they usually let me through here, no problem. All right, <laughs> way to boast. I guess it's different now that I'm traveling with a weak ass lame-o. Oh man, that's so evil, you evil person. I like their chemistry though, they're funny. Um, all right, that's uh, an interesting enemy right there. <laughs> okay, let's do that. Oh my God, there's a flexing arm. It reminds me of Undertale, like the, like the weird enemies. Look, Faye, I get it. You love hogging the spotlight, but are you planning on sharing it anytime soon? If you get tired out there, feel free to tag me in by pressing Q, E or L, B and R, B. Oh, you can tag them in. You can tag me in at any moment, unless you're getting hit. Don't get me wrong. It's pretty sweet kicking it back here, regenerating my hype bar at a faster rate. Ah, cool. But I can slap this bass pretty hard. Of course, if you'd rather turn tail and run, just press the R key uh, left trigger. I won't judge much. Beware that some foes won't let us escape that easily. All right, so I'm gonna definitely gonna tag him in. Awesome, he's got like a fish um, guitar. Interesting, I love it when he's in the background. He's like got those little like mascot little things. He's like, yeah, <laughs> I love that. And then when my one's back there, she's just chilling. All right, we're gonna use some muscles. We're gonna flex and apply fortify to our bar. Oh yeah. Look at those bulging muscles dude and now it's like we've got like extra defense or something so that's really cool so he's more like a tanky kind of dude i think i wonder if i changed back would i still have the fortify i would that's very nice actually i like that so we can also weaken the enemy so let's try this out apparently they've got haste on right now so now they are weakened right i see cool stuff it almost looks like twigs or something around the the bar <laughs> strange this guy's really slow though like i feel like his bar moves at a snail pace it's really really slow slow okay so we're going to do a mega pop slap let's try this out wow <laughs> That was amazing. I like that. It did a lot of damage as well, actually. This tree monster is so strange looking. Really odd, but okay. Then we're going to do our signature beat. The noise, it just slaps it. Wow. Okay. All right. We're going to tag the other character in. What's he doing? He made like a noise with his nose. That's a little odd. All right, we're going to try this. I do also have another skill that I want to try out on my other character. There was a skill that I could like change out. So I want to change it back so I can like test that out. That would be really awesome. All right, here we go. So let's go into mods. I'm going to go into this dude. We're going to swap out Intimidate with the other one. Um, zero Hertz, this one. I just like want to see like what it does in combat. I want to see like the animations and that kind of stuff. Um, there is a treasure chest there. I do not know how to get to it though. There must be like a secret little way to go or something like that. I am assuming lots of enemies in this area for sure. Oh, here we go. Secret little entrance. <laughs> awesome i thought there would be something around here that's cool so there's going to be lots of secret things skull splitter all right faye headbutts her guitar as you do nice um we're gonna apply one measure of feedback to the enemy i'm gonna put that on as well because i want to try out all these things so what one shall i get rid of i'm gonna get rid of this one and we're gonna have skull splitter very nice indeed can't wait to try that out in a second i'm just going 
going to run ahead a little bit. I want to talk to this guy here. He's called Box, okay? I was supposed to be delivering these boxes to Ho Ho, but I can't be asked to take that bus again. So I'm just hanging back here for a while. Though that scream earlier really glummed me out. Oh yeah, that was my friend, Claire. But don't worry, she'll be fine. We're on the case. Right, nice. You guys seem pretty cool. Hey, uh, help yourselves to anything in the boxes. Wow, really? Yeah, screw it. I'm sure you'll value this stuff way more than some bozo in a shop. The party's merch has been fully restocked. Wow, nice, thanks. I spy a lovely person. Hee <laughs> hee. Nice, a lovely person. Uh, help yourself to anything in the boxes. Right, okay, so you can just restore it there. That's very nice indeed. I love all the poses the trees make. <laughs> That's awesome. We also have a restoring thing here. What's that here? That sound the fish is making is incredibly relaxing. Ocean sounds, baby, soothes the soul. Oh, yes. I guess the curse allows music to heal as well as hurt us. That's something at least. Right, that's very true. All right, let's go to the next area and see what we've got. I'm sure we're gonna have an opportunity to test these new skills out as well in a second when I can find an enemy. I did just run past two, but I don't know. I was just a bit too lazy to fight those ones at that time. I wanted to see what was ahead. Ah, here we go. Let's fight this weird bulging muscle thing and see what we got here. See if we can try out our new skills. So I got headbutt. We're going to try headbutting the enemy. Go! Oh my god, <laughs> not the enemy. I head did that hurt me? That hurt me as well. I suppose that makes sense. Like she did headbutt her guitar after all. And we also have, let me see, what was the other skill? I think it was this one, zero hertz. It does heavy noise damage to all foes. So let's try this out. Oh my god such a classic i love it a giant whale appeared what why i don't know maybe i shouldn't ask questions i think i should like have this character in her bar moves way faster than the other dude and maybe i should have that in when um i'm waiting for my turn because it definitely goes faster all right let's explore around see what we can find here oh my oh oh my god wow look at that beauty what's a hunk holy moly but don't let his good looks fool you he'd eat us alive if it had the chance seriously where do you think it gets all the calories to gain that kind of mass from plants don't make me laugh Blimey, we better make sure we're prepared then. So our first boss fight is a really hunky snail. Right, sure. <laughs> Let's do this. I think. <laughs> I think I'm ready. All right, I'm going to do, I'm going to start with, I'm going to start with haste. So we're going to speed up our characters and stuff. So that's going to be really sick. Alrighty, ouch, that really hurt. Oh, that must be the sick technique K-Quack was referring to. Oh no, now I'm dealing damage. We're going to swap out and we are going to fortify my bar because, you know, Faye is like kind of dying and I think this would help a lot. I'm still taking damage here, but that's okay. Uh, what's he doing? He's got like hands for antennas. Right, okay, this is so odd. We're going to use some merch. Can I use it on the... No, it has to be the other person. Right, here we go. I'm going to use it on this girl here. There we go. Get some health back because her health was like kind of low after that. We are going to... I'm just going to swap out a sec. I'm going to see if I've got any more buffs or anything like that. We could do this one. We could do Face Melter because it does two bits of pain to the enemy. So that will probably help us out. I feel like this is going to be like really strategic. So I like that. I really want to do that headbutt, but I can't do it for some reason. Um, maybe it doesn't work on this boss. I don't know. Let's see what else I got. I'm going to do moderate noise damage to a single foe. We're going to do a mega pop sap. Let's see how much this actually does. I wonder how much health it has. I do like it when it actually shows the health of your enemies, but... I guess that's just the way it is. This fortify thing is really helping. I have to say he's really not doing a whole lot of damage to me right now. I like this pop attack, so I'm going to keep trying to, to do this. I wonder if there's a way to actually get rid of these things on my bar, because that's really annoying, actually. All right, we're going to do another one. Here we go. Another one of these awesome moves. And um, maybe I should, like, swap characters soon or something. Actually, wait, we could do this. we got haste on that one which I've already done. Let's use the headbutt. 
It also applies one measure of feedback to the enemy. It also hurts me though, which kind of sucks, but I'm just gonna just gonna go with that. Hopefully she doesn't kill me. Don't kill me. Maybe this was a bad idea. Oh boy, that was close. All right, we're gonna use another one of these before I completely die. Oh my God, look at all that poison. <laughs> That is a lot of poison. Wow. Okay. How long does my fortify stay on for? It's been on for absolutely ages. I have a I I think that this pop um skill is probably the best one I've got right now. Oh, the shell has unraveled into a luscious, impressive arm. <laughs> okay. Its defense may be down, leaving it open for attacks. But I bet it can clap really hard now. We should be careful. So that means it's going to do more damage. Right, okay. I need to be careful of that. I have got Fortify on, so that should help. What's what's he doing? Oh gosh, uh, this looks bad. 29. That was that was painful. So let's heal up a little bit because um, I, of course, don't want to die on this boss fight. He's really cool though. It's really fun. I really like this. I wasn't sure what to expect for this. Oh, he just got rid of all his debuffs. Um, okay, let me see what I can do here. I should be able to swap and do some stuff here. We're going to add, we're going to put that back on. We're going to give him some pain. There we go. Awesome. Just like we've got, because we've got a lot of pain to be honest. And we are going to add haste to my bar. Maybe it will get rid of these horrible things. Yes, there we go. That get got rid of two of those horrible thingies. So that's awesome. We need some health. So we're going to go with that this turn. I did want to attack, but that's just the way it goes. I can't use anything. I guess I don't have enough hype, I guess. So now we are going to... I'm just going to do a Mega Pop Slap because I really like this move. I've used this one a lot, actually, but I really like it. All right. Well, I think we're I think we're doing pretty well. I think we're making good progress. It's going to do this one again. He had full hype as well, so that's good. He regenerates a lot. What? Where's he going? Rip. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> that's amazing. <laughs> that was really funny. <laughs> I really like this. It's just so quirky. <laughs> so funny such a tragic waste of muscle but i suppose in a way the muscle has merely transferred to us i guess for we have grown stronger from the fight yeah look at those muscles yo epic epic stuff we are killing it we are on a roll awesome the weird tree arm moved hey we did it we impressed the forest. Nice. And all it took was a triumphant battle of musical strength. Actually, it was the victory flexing you guys just did that won, that won me over. <laughs> it was really something. I just had to join in. All right then. Well, I'm glad we made you happy, I guess. <laughs> that was really cool. Okay, so I'm going to go back and find the arm. I'm not sure where it was, actually. I'm going to have to go find it. Was it up here? I get the feeling it was up here. Yeah, I think it's here. There's a treasure chest. How how do you get that? What the? Who puts a treasure chest just out of reach like that? Maybe the real treasure is knowing that someday you might find out. Yeah, clearly. <laughs> well, that was a bit mean. That was such a tease. All right, let's see what's up here. What adventures are we going to get into this time? So where's Briff? Does he know about the contest yet? Nah, he was asleep. Why didn't you wake him up? I tried, but you know what he's like. He sleeps through anything. I was hitting him with some serious righteous, righteous licks, but he was just snoring all the way through it. So I just left him. <laughs> wow, classic Briff. Oh, well, we can tell him later. So there's obviously another party member here. We've changed. Oh, wow, we can choose which character we can control. So that's really cool. I didn't even realize you could do that. So that's pretty awesome. I wonder what those arrows are on the wall there i am not sure let me see if i can go down and check that out uh i don't know how to oh, okay strange graffiti whoa check out the graffiti pretty righteous what oh god no to think someone was granted access through here by the great arm of tonewood only to vandalize this sacred inner sanctum wow this guy is really passionate what a horrific breach of trust my heart is breaking <laughs> okay but the colors are nice look green and white your favorite they're not my favorite anymore Oh, <laughs> he's he's a funny dude. All right, let's continue. 
I want to see if I can find some more. I want some more monsters. I like the monsters in this game. Whoa, what the bloody hell is that? I have no idea. Oh my, okay, that's Claire. Oh my god. Ian, that was not what I was, I was expecting. How's it going, Claire? And they're just having a normal conversation. Claire, that's Claire. Your friend Claire is a giant tree goddess. Yeah, I was not expecting that naturally. <laughs> goddess? I'll have to remember that one. Uh, what are you doing? Oh no, Claire, what's going on? Something is in my hair, continuously scratching. I can't take it much more. Please help me. I bet it's the same idiot that cut down that tone wood. What? Someone cut down one of my precious tone woods? You didn't know? Y yeah. Pretty sure it was Toby. Want me to beat him up? I guess I've been too busy dealing with this horrible scratching to notice. Oh, the scratching. Losing a tone wood was an awful day. Don't worry, Claire. We'll get to the bottom of this, won't we, Faye? Uh, now nah, we won't. Ah, uh, you're a dead weight anyway. Who needs you? <laughs> Thank you, Ian. I'll be sure to return the favour someday. Here, you can use this braid as a bridge. I hope whatever's in there doesn't give you too much trouble. Best of luck. Right, okay, let's do this. <laughs> this is so weird. Oh, do we actually... We go, we're going inside? All right. This is in... Oh, no! <laughs> I so wanted to see what was in there. Oh, dude. <laughs> that was amazing. I wasn't sure what to expect with this one, but it definitely blew away my expectations. I really enjoyed that. Have you also tried this game out? I would love to hear your thoughts on this game. I just want to say a huge thank you to all of my Patreons. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. I really appreciate that. And if you are interested in donating, there will be a link in the description box below to my Patreon page. It's only $1 a month to gain access and I'm currently uploading exclusive anime review videos only on Patreon. Thank you for watching, please comment, rate and subscribe and I hope I'll see you next time!